Johnny, that meeting was held in Mayfair after three people were shot to death, killed, ambushed on Monday night. There was a lot of passion and, of course, talk about what to do next. Feeling helpless in the middle of a gun violence crisis in Philadelphia. They came out to Lincoln High School in Mayfair to brainstorm solutions. That's where we caught up with Wayne Van Hest, who tells NBC10 he's seen five murders in his Northeast neighborhood in the last year. What kind of changes can you make to stay safe? I carry. Simple as that. I don't know what else to tell you. Something I've never done in my 67 years of life, I never carried. So we take it serious, and we will continue to take it serious, because we don't want them to win. A deadly Monday night in Mayfair led to this meeting. Three were shot dead, according to investigators, ambushed as they walked across the street near Roland and Guilford. They say gunmen unloaded more than 50 shots. We can't keep having meeting after meeting after meeting with no results because with no results, then people become more frustrated and angry to a point. Earlier in the day, state and city lawmakers announced major funding coming to Philadelphia to address gun violence. $105 million in state and federal money is going to neighborhood groups. That will fund initiatives in technology education, paid work experiences, youth mentoring, and mental health and trauma. This investment in these neighborhood and community focused intervention programs is designed to stop the violence before it starts, to bring opportunities to young people, to bring supports to young people. So a lot of money you heard right there coming this way. As for that meeting in Mayfair, an awful lot of brainstorming, a lot of talk about solutions, and those included increased patrols and better lighting in neighborhoods. Outside of police headquarters, we're live. I'm Aaron Baskerville.